Hey, look at this guy. Welcome to game 153. Now, this is gonna be really quite short of a stream session because of how this game works. If you think of Chibi Mario chan this game is. Alright, man. This game is in the same vein as that. It's like a board game. Party game, board game sort of deal. And honestly, it looks really cool. So, I don't know everything that I'm gonna be doing. I just glanced at this for a few minutes. But, I think we can get by and it'll be short. Alright, so you hit start. We've got three options here. I think... I don't know what the second one is. The... Like, this one is continue, I think? A game? Anyway, we'll just start a new game. I don't know if this one is a... Oh, shit. Now I've got your power. Yo, hi, says Sarge with the 25 months. Sarge... <laughs> Sarge, you subbed... When did you last sub? The fuck? 25 months. It's technically 26 months, because one of them doubled up. I remember. <clears throat> huh, weird. It actually says one month ago. Oh no, no it wasn't. It was 20 days ago. 20 days ago. I guess it's getting close. Getting close. Ha ha ha! Yeah, thanks for the continued subbing. Anyway, I might have chosen the wrong option here. I don't know what's going on now. I thought it was just the first one. Maybe it was the second one we wanted. But yeah, this is a pretty cool looking game. I don't know if this is like a story mode or something. That'd be crazy. It seemed to be just a multiplayer mode. I don't know what's happening. It's not resuming, is it? Because I did, you know, I went in, so there was a game made. Twist tells you that the next 20th you can resub. Okay. Twitch, Twitch is, I don't know. Choo choo! So yeah, this game, you take a train around a board. If you imagine Monopoly, this game is a lot like Monopoly. You roll a dice, you go land on a space. Now, blue spaces give you money, a random amount. Yellow spaces gives you, like, an event, and red spaces takes money away from you. I don't know what we're currently doing at the moment, though, with that option I chose. Because you're supposed to be able to pick your character and stuff. Alright, here, let me reset. I don't know if that was... I don't know what that mode was. <laughs> what I, it might have been also a continue. This should be a new game. Right, and then you select the number of players. So this is just gonna be me. <clears throat> or, I think I can choose... Oh, I can't go back. I don't know what those options are asking. Yeah, now you can choose your characters, and I want to show them off. You've got some crazy freaking characters here. You got Unicorn Head, you got Demon Boy, Kappa, I think, Monkey, the Unicorn Girl, there's a cat, another demon, and another demon. A lot of demons. Like, three demons. Demon Family. So, I don't know. We'll play... Play the cat. <clears throat> Doesn't look like a kappa. I don't know what else it would be. Except for a kappa. Some sort of bird face thing. Okay, and then you name your character. Or is she default? And right now, we choose how long the game is going to last, so you can make it extremely long. 
The way this works is how many years you're gonna play the game for. We're gonna play for one year. You can't choose zero, so one is the minimum. And that's why this is going to be a really short experience. That's 12 turns. And you just have to accrue the most money and assets. Right, so you've got, uh... I don't know what that first mode was. I'm not sure. It might have just been resuming. This, I'm also not sure if this is like picking a random event or what. And you start with like a... Th I think this is supposed to be representative of 10,000 yen or some absurdly high amount of yen money. But yeah. I don't know what most of these options are. I know this one, you can look around this map, so I just want to show off the map. Got cool looking cutesy creatures everywhere and just random shit. <laughs> Happy rice balls, golf playing bunnies, we got some fishies and squiddies and hot baths, a mountain. Cows, horses. This map is huge. I'm still scrolling up. Seahorses, <laughs> starfish. So, if you were to play a really long game of this, there's these zones way out here in the, the oceans. Like, you can take the airport to go out to the ocean. I think it cycled over once. What you want to do is buy property. So like I was saying, blue spaces give you money, yellow spaces give you like an event. I'm not really sure what they do. Red spaces take money away. Black, these spaces here are properties to buy. So you want to land on those and buy them. And then this does, I don't even know, I think you can buy an item or something. There's a lot of unknowns, but the game seems pretty cool. If, if it was in English, I think, I don't know, it would be fun to play. So, I want to land on blue first, and you can go backwards. I don't want to take the airport, although that might be the best option here. You can see your movements. We'll go up this way. There you go, I got 550 bucks. Do do to the OST. That's the AI. Okay, he lost that money. And then you get a little picture. Oh, yeah, I was mashing A. I'll try not to mash A on the next one. <clears throat> For every every turn is like an entire month. So yellow space does this. I don't know if these are items or events. I think they're events because I've seen like an angel appear and I've seen a baby appear before when I was play testing. You can land on these main buildings to get other events and stuff. And that was that was all the AI AI is skipping all this text, I'm not hitting the button. Yeah, I can't, I cannot tell what's going on. <laughs> I wish I understood that. This looks like a game that would be cool to have uh, a translation for. I think he can just buy any property he wants from there. Maybe. Damn. Or is he getting stocks or something? Maybe he's in debt, I don't know. He's probably doing very well for himself. Gotta love the little cutscenes. Choo choo! Alright, two spaces. I'm just gonna land here. And then... Uh... Yeah, I'm not sure what this means. These are like grayed out. You would think I could afford this stuff, but maybe that's like getting stocks or something. Uh, maybe I can't do anything there. Couldn't tell you what's going on. 
It looked like I lost 450 bucks or something. But it wouldn't let me buy nothing. So, I don't know. <laughs> Game seems fascinating now. If I could understand the language, I would be down for playing this with like a full group of people. It seems like it would be pretty cool. Oh, I've got the baby following me. Welcome back. So I've seen this before. I don't know if, like, all of my money was taken away or something. <laughs> Seems bad if you land in their spaces <laughs> and don't make a purchase. So maybe I should avoid them. Choo-choo! Dude, we're getting wrecked. Yeah, we're at minus 450. What happened to all my monies, man? I don't even know. Uh, one, two, three, four. I'm just gonna land on blue. Uh, nope. Maybe. I don't know, I haven't played Smash in a while. Dude, that guy is making bank. Getting wrecked by the computer. I didn't mean to skip that, I wanna see all of this. We're in autumn, so it'll all be over soon. Crap. <clears throat> Yeah, I guess I can't afford any of this stuff. I might be in, like, the rich part of town or something. <laughs> it just seems... Oh, they took a thousand dollars away. Unless someone else owns those spaces. You know how the computer bought out a bunch of stuff? Maybe he bought out all those surrounding tiles and I keep just landing on his property. And that's what I'm paying him. That's probably what's happening. I can't tell who owns what. I have no idea what's happening here. These damn tomatoes. Oh yeah, feast. Choo choo. <clears throat> Maybe I should try landing on the main zone. I feel like all those event messages are from the like character that's following us. I don't know. Already Christmas. It's already winter. Yeah, 12 turns will go fast. We are almost done. One, two. Yeah, I can land here. Probably can't do anything now. Yeah. Dude, he took 3,000 bucks. What a grubby bastard. Does this guy ever <laughs> leave you alone? I don't know. Okay, he's some sort of item. Happy New Year! I'm just trying to land on some blue spaces, man. on the boat now. 150. Oof. <clears throat> it's nothing good coming of this. I don't know what the AI is up to.
no good, surely, with a sound effect like that. Alright, so I'm just gonna keep moving around. <clears throat> yeah, the star space lets you, like, purchase a bunch of different stuff. I don't know what any of this is, but some of those look familiar from RPGs. Like, this one, or the third one from the top looks like a potion or something. So, I don't know. They might be items. <clears throat> is he stuck, or is he sending the baby back out after me? <laughs> He's just chilling there, doing something. Anyway, this is the end of the game. So, obviously... I'm not winning. Okay, I don't know why it displays other characters here. It's, they weren't even involved in the game. Or was that just the AI with the monkey, maybe? Anyway, that's literally it. This is the ending scene. And I guess I'll let this play out just to document it. Because <clears throat> after this, this loops infinitely until you reset the system. I'll show you what I mean once uh, I let these play, but... Yeah, this is about it. About it. <laughs> We got blue and red Oni. Yeah, see, no one seems to like that kid that follows you around. Probably just takes all your money. It sort of looked like he was doing to me. <laughs> and then there's Mothra for some reason. If you played a really long game, you could probably find a lot of cool events in this title. And. For the purposes of our challenge, due to the nature of this game, it's already finished, right? There's no reason to go longer, you get the same ending whether you win or lose. Which is just this. And this is a long ending. I have no idea what that flower in the building is spewing forth. But yeah, if I... I feel like this game is probably really cool. I definitely won't be doing it do justice here. Oh no, Santa! <laughs> <laughs> He's just like, I'm out of here, kid. <laughs> yeah, GG. It would be cool to see more of what the game has to offer, but I don't really want to do a longer match, especially with so many unknowns anyway. This works out for me. It makes it nice and simple. Real short experience. This was a peachy adventure. Yeah, it was. That peach is extremely purple. I'm not sure, I think it's repeating. There's a point where this starts just loops infinitely. I think we've already passed that point. So yeah, you can hit A or any button. You get into a stat screen. Damn, he had seventy-seven, seven thousand seven hundred seventy dollars. <laughs> Negative forty-three hundred. And then this screen comes up, and I think it's just telling you what all you have and what all you don't have. So I don't know what these are, but we've got zero, four, zero, three, eight, and zero. Well, the AI has one, two, two, three, one, and zero. So you start with some stuff. 
Anyway, you hit B, you get to a graph of your performance. It's kind of like Dokopan Kingdom in that sense, I suppose. It makes me think of Dokopan. You hit A again and it just comes back to here, and all these screens like infinitely loop. You can't get out of this, as you can see. You have to reset the game. But yeah, that's uh, Momotaro Dentetsu. I mean, I can't really comment too much about it, because even if I go in again, I don't really know what's going on with the game fully, but it seems fun. It seems just like a... What's the name of that game? It came out recently. It was on the Wii. It has Dragon Quest characters and the Final Fantasy characters. I think... No, Mario characters and Dragon Quest characters. Fortune Street. This game reminds me of Fortune Street. If anybody's played that, yeah, Fortune Street. Except it's train themed. I mean, it seems cool. I just can't comment about it too much. And choosing the first option, I don't know what this first option is doing. I think the first option is like a continue, because now it's telling me to select players. But we could do like four players. And then this is humans. We have one human. I think. I think that's what it is. Hopefully. Maybe the first one was humans. <laughs> Let's be the demon lady. Okay, the first one might have been humans. So yeah, I think the first option is just setting up a... Uh, a game if it wasn't already continuing. It was probably continuing from the last one I had. You can save at some point. I don't know how to save in the middle of a match, but if you're doing a long 99 year playthrough, saving would be useful. Anyway, I don't have too much else to say. <laughs> this one's uh, one and done. Yeah, I'll go. I'll try to go one more time. I'll turn off the console. <laughs> The thing is, I don't have time to stream something else, depending, because my friends want to play Kingdom Death Monster, I said I would today. Next game on the challenge is another baseball game, so I don't have time for that. It's probably going to take a while. But uh, I can do maybe another run of this and try to win. Just to say I won. Excuse me. <coughs> Hiccups. Let me get a drink. I do want to stream King of Death Monster, we'll see. I don't even know what's going on. Did it just reset? The game that we had prior. Is there one AI or is this a human? No, that's an AI. It might have reset at the match we had prior. I'll count 12 turns and see if this lasts 12 turns. I'm very confused if it's like continuing from an auto save of some sort. This is turn two. Going places. Oh, let's see if he can make use of that. No, he decided not to. Alright, that was three. I'm just gonna pick up a bunch of blue zones first. And then I'll see if I can't, like, purchase property somewhere. 
Oh, sorry for the chair squeaking. That's four. There's so many different ways you can go right off the bat. I don't know what the overall strategy is here. Hard to tell. Really interested on where the AI is going this time. Just cruising in the seas. Making monies. Hey, that was five. One, two, three. Alright, why don't I go here? Can I afford this or no? See, it won't let me, like, purchase any of these things. I'm not sure why. I don't know if this is to sell or something else. Well, it seems like nothing bad happened to me that time. So it is that baby character that was following me. Makes bad stuff happen. I don't know how you get rid of him. Seems very dastardly. He's got big monies. Big money maker. One, two, three, four. About us. Seems like medium money, so we're making medium. Guess there's just more money to be made out in the sea. So he's grinding. Grinding. Dun 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 Alright, I have two spaces I can move. Why don't I check out this castle? Yeah, possibly. Okay, I can buy from here. Can I get all three? I don't know what the bottom stuff is. <laughs> Look at them octopods. <clears throat> You're playing what? Yeah, I figured you were still on the team tactics. Pudding. Mm, where do we go? I guess we'll take a yellow. <laughs> you have a long way to go though, overall. Should be like four turns left. What do you mean reverse? Well, I haven't played in a while, but it used to work that way. some monies. All these red spaces here. Guess I'll just land on yellow. I don't know what any of those yellows are doing. We saw the AI like utilize some items. Maybe I can utilize some items. I just don't know how. Something happened. <laughs> Alright, he's buying. 
science stuff. Oh shit, the power play! Cause he lands on that. Damn. Ah, he sent the baby after me again. How did I do that? Yeah, I used my items. I don't know what any of them do. I don't know what any of this is for either. Let's just get this. Dude, this kid is like <laughs> so dangerous. He just takes money from you. Oh, I have to sell a property now. Evil AI got us again. Thought we were doing okay this time. Not knowing how to get rid of the kid or like how that entity works in this game makes it really difficult if I want to win. Okay, I don't know what's happening now. at the end. This is a little different. Or was that an end of the year review? Something like that. Oh boy. Well, we got screwed by the dice. <laughs> Landing on a red space, losing money. Because all our property. Jeez, this game seems brutal. All I know, bad stuff's going down. Like tons of money lost, getting pilfered by the kid, landing on red, losing your buildings. Okay, I'm just gonna choo choo around. I am pretty fascinated by this game. now. I don't know what that other stuff is. Maybe it's a different unit of measurement. Maybe it's like a million dollars you need or something. That was for a really late game. This baby is the worst. Or is he giving me money? I don't know. He needs to go away from me though. Okay, we've seen that icon before. So I don't know if this is like, uh... Story mode or what? There's no information on this game. <laughs> Based on what I looked into. I'm, I'm imagining all of the guy's properties lost value or something. Sucks for him. <laughs> uh, one, two, three, four.
nowhere seemingly nice to go. Okay, he's definitely still taking money from me. <laughs> Meanwhile, the AI is just buying up all the houses. They just upgraded them <laughs> in that area. Doing good. Okay, so the second option might just be a buy them all. Or buy all available, that's what it seems like. Cool if I could get this guy off of me. Comes the evil storm cloud. Raining on something. Wonder how much this game does events based on intentionally like screwing a player. Dude, that's the AI. It like took all the stuff away. Seems like. <clears throat> I don't know. Took some of his stuff away. It looked like he had to sell. game goes for to be an endless mode. Is there a way to tell what turn it is? Looks like it's the 11th month maybe? Telephone shopping. This is a mobile buy items item. Oh uh, yeah. Mind that now. <laughs> I don't know what we did on the third. Ugh, a blind player tries to navigate board game. Not a good look. <laughs> What is I don't know this? Double dice with different music. See, this game is fucking cool. I don't know. I I need somebody to teach me what's going on so we can play this game. Mostly, how do you get rid of that kid? He's literally been on us for an entire year's worth of turns. Just taking money away. I can understand why in the credits scene everyone's running away from this baby character. 
Surely one of these items here is an anti-baby item. Okay, I don't think that's working. Triple dice item! Oh, look, it's red. Hold up, I don't have to go around this way. I don't know if you can, like, lose the kid somehow. Damn. We are in hella negatives. Mostly looking for uh, some sort of repellent here. A five dice item. Oh crap! That just keeps multiplying. I like how the train changes to like a bullet train. He'll never find me. Oh no, he found me. I keep landing on red spaces too. Not really paying attention to where I'm going. Lay down, Max. We over yet? Okay, looks like it's over. Man, that was torture. As soon as the AI summons the kid, I don't know how to summon it on him. That would be like the main thing you need to learn. all snow horse there's all kinds of creatures out there on that overworld map okay so it's the same thing I don't know it seemed like a two-year event and we just get the same ending I don't think it would be different if I came in first I have yet to win it uh, when I was doing the practice I lost two because of the baby Alright, I guess that'll do it for this game. Yeah, there's no getting out of this menu. So, I'm intrigued. I probably need to watch some videos of this being played. Maybe I can understand what's going on. You know, or learn the language. That's really hard to do. But we'll call it quits here. As for streaming, I should be back on later. I don't know when we're getting together, I just want to knock this one out, because I knew it was going to be fast. That didn't even take an hour, right? No, that was only like 45 minutes. <laughs> and then we finished the first game in like 20 minutes. Yeah, thanks for stopping by. I, I should hopefully have a more full stream to come. Well, I don't know though, we'll see.